What is going on guys? I'm going to show you how to find all of Nordley's War Story letters. But before we get into this, be sure to check the annotations or the end screen of this video to see the other videos that I've posted for all the other letter locations for the other War Stories in Battlefield 5. Alright, the first letter is located after you've made it down the mountain with your skis. And you're going to stop just around where this broken down tree is. You're going to see behind you is a bridge and over to your left is a tower gonna make it towards the left a little bit and kind of curve your way around and you're gonna see two soldiers by a campfire one of them will probably end up walking off and then you can take out the soldier that's right there by the campfire and you're gonna see a letter right there on the ground next you're gonna want to take the path to your right and go off the road just a little bit you'll see a path that's gonna lead down to where the bridge is at and you're gonna go under the bridge when you made it onto the other side of the bridge, there'll be a soldier to your left that you can take out if you don't want to alert any alarms. Then you go to the right a little bit, and you're going to go and find the main road that will be on your right. You're going to follow that road down just a little bit more, and then you're going to see some footprints in the snow. You're going to want to follow those footprints as it weaves around the side of the mountain, and it's going to lead you to a bunch of cabins where there are soldiers. You're going to want to take out those soldiers and then go to the cabin that's on the far right. In there you're gonna find the second letter you're then gonna to want to make it out of this cabin and to your left there are gonna be some stairs you take those stairs all the way down there are gonna be some soldiers right there to your right if you want to take them out and then you're gonna go on to the main road towards your left you're gonna see as it curves around you can see the main gate in front of you you don't want to go all the way up to that gate you want to go to the right side again seeing more footprints in the snow you're going to follow that all the way to the side of this massive complex where you're going to see another soldier you're going to want to take out and then you're going to go through the gate and then there will be another soldier right in front of you and once you've finished him you're going to want to pick up the letter that is right there next to his body then you're going to want to take the path that you're just on as it curves just a little bit to your left you'll see the gate that you're looking outside a second ago and then you're going to take a sharp right and you're going to follow that path off the right a little bit as it follows a little bit down where the cliff is at then you're going to see a tree that's broken down you can use that as a bridge to cross over you're going to follow that path as it continues to your right and then you're going to go up a little bit more to your right and you're going to see two flight of stairs you're going to follow those stairs all the way up to this perch you can see a sniper rifle behind you that is silent so if you want to take out those enemy players down below you can but if you want to remain a little more stealthy you could take the pathway to your left there are some armed guards patrolling this area but you can take them out using your sniper gun or your throwing knives you can follow that pathway to your left then you take a right and you're going to go up where you see the first flight of stairs and then you're going to take your first right and cross over there'll be some pipes that you can jump on that will lead you through a window and so you're going to be on the very top of this building here inside and you can cross over you'll see me kind of fall down to the ground um, but you're going to want to get onto the second floor so i'm going to go back up these stairs then i'm going to cross over a bridge that connects these two buildings together and then i'm going to immediately take a right i'm going to go through another set of doors take a left and then you can see a room over there to your left you're going to go into that room and you're going to get the letter that's on the desk now you're going to have to complete a little bit more of the war story. So to your left is going to be the door where they're holding the resistant fighter. You're going to want to complete that part and then do the part where you defend. And then where you destroy the electrical substation units. And then you're going to ski all the way down to the bridge. And that's the part where you're going to get pushed off the bridge. And then when you get back onto the ground, you're going to move into the next part to find the rest of the letters. What you're going to want to do is just continue up this path. And it's going to get you onto the ice. You see a little bit off to your left there's gonna be a few trees and a little bit of a hill you can climb and you can go right up that little hill and you're gonna see a letter there on a tree stump you're gonna to want to stay warm here as part of this mission is that you don't freeze so you're gonna to want to find some fire along the way so if you continue up the path just a little bit you'll see a broken down cabin and just around there there's gonna be a soldier you need to take out and then you can warm yourself by that fire once you're warm enough, you're going to follow more footprints in the snow that are going to lead you over to the left side. You're going to go up the side of the mountain a little bit, and you're going to see more soldiers that are camped out. This is another place that will be able to warm you up, but as well, there will be a letter for you to find right by this campsite. You're then going to want to continue going down this pass alongside the side of the mountain. It's going to work you down the mountain, and you can look over to your right. There will be some soldiers on another campsite. You want to go there to get warm again. 
once you've warmed yourself there you're going to want to continue up another mountain this time and you're going to take this pathway up you can continue it all the way up and take out the soldiers right there or you can be a little more stealthy go off to the left side a little bit wrap yourself around and work yourself up the right side and then there should be a little bit of a hut towards your right um, there again are more soldiers around that general area so just be careful if you're trying to be stealthy and then you're going to want to go inside the hut you can warm yourself up there and you're going to find a letter inside this hut you're then going to want to get outside the hut and take a left you're going to follow these footprints all the way down they're going to start to turn a little bit to the right but you're going to continue going straight you want to make it down this mountain so the mountain is going to curve down a little bit and you're going to want to find the path that's the easiest for you to get down the mountain without taking a lot of damage then you can see a tree trunk across the pathway here go to the right side of this tree trunk you want to get up on top of this little hill and then you're going to see some more footprints in the snow. You want to cross those footprints next to where there's a large rock. And then you want to continue going straight ahead and you're going to see a body that's frozen on the ground. And there's going to be a letter beside it. You're then going to want to find those footprints in the snow again. That's going to lead you down the right direction to find an area for you to get warm. And once you've gotten warm, you're going to finish the rest of this mission as you're going to go find some more soldiers again just ahead of you. You're going to get warm again by the fire. This is the part where you're going to lose the satchel and you're going to need to try to track it down and catch it as you fall down into the water. And then you make it into a hut and get yourself warm up there again. Now you finally made it to the final part. We're going to find the rest of the letters. There are three sections where you have objectives to complete for the campaign. You have the depot, the docks, and the village. When it comes to the depot side, there are no letters in that location. So if you're trying to complete the campaign alongside the letters, you may just want to go over there and complete the depot side and then move over to the docks. But before you go on and do that, you want to ski down here just a little bit and make a left right before you reach those buildings and then work your way up just a little bit more and you're going to find the first letter in this location. But now if you want to go complete the depot side of the campaign mission, you can. Once you've done that, you want to make your way all the way over to the docks and go over to the left side where the frozen lake is leading up to the docks. You'll see a massive crane with a ladder leading up to the very top. You want to climb that ladder to the very top and right behind you, you will see a letter. Now you can go complete this side of the campaign mission if you want and then you can go all the way back down the very ladder you came up on and look behind you and you're going to see a boat that's sticking out the ice and if you go over to where that boat is at you're going to see inside the boat is going to be another letter. You're then going to want to make your way around the boat and head towards the bridge and you're going to go under that second passageway towards your left and under there to your right you're going to find another letter. You're then going to want to take a right and go all the way down this bridge and you're going to follow the pathway. There are going to be a few guards there so be careful for that. Then you want to continue down the pathway again and if you want to you'll see then a red building that will indicate that you're in the village location. So if you want to go and complete that part of the mission you can or you can veer off a little bit to the left and take this pathway over here. This will take you all the way down next to where there is a green house and then you go past that greenhouse to a broken down white house that you can go right into and if you go on the very top into the third story where the attic is at you'll find another letter and now we can finally get the last letter for this campaign so what you're gonna want to do is get out of this building and get onto the snowy road and take a left we're gonna take this all the way down to the bunker but just a heads up if you have not completed the depot the docks and the village parts of the objectives for this campaign the bunker will not be open for you so do make sure you've already completed those and once you have already done that you go down to the bunker here you're gonna see a tower with a bunch of soldiers that you're gonna have to take out once you've done that the bunker will already be open if you've completed those objectives previously and then you can go into the bunker follow it all the way down and at the very end towards the right there's gonna be a door you can enter in and there is your final letter and that is how to find all of Nordley's letter for Battlefield 5's campaign Hope that helps you guys out. I am Livin, and I'll catch you guys again later.